Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm doing a little bit of a different video. This is a comparison between each model of the 2020 Volkswagen Jetta and I'm lucky enough to have each trim model or trim level in the same color. So it can really point out the differences instead of trying to visualize and maybe missing something because a different color model is used. So this is Pyrite Silver Metallic. In the foreground here we have a Jetta S. This is an automatic transmission. It's also available with a manual transmission. This is a Jetta SE 1.4. These are all 1.4s. This is a Jetta R-Line, also available in a manual transmission. A Jetta SEL and a Jetta SEL Premium. All pyrite silver, all have black interior. The R-Line has a black interior with a twist. It has a two-tone Shetland interior. Alloy wheels are the same on the SEL and the SEL Premium. The R-Line has this sporty wheel. The SE has this wheel. And the S has this wheel, which is basically the SE wheel, just not painted black in spots. They're all going to feature LED headlights, LED taillights. Same nice bold line down the side catches the light right under the door handles there. Right into the wheel arches from the taillights. A molded in spoiler on the back. The S is the only one that doesn't come with keyless entry or a panoramic sunroof. Let's take a look inside the S. This one starts out at $21,385. The extras on this one are going to be the driver assistance package with forward collision warning, autonomous emergency braking, and blind spot monitoring, uh, and also uh, rear traffic alert. This one here also has roadside assistance kit for another $85 that brings it to $21,385. On the inside, nice plastic steering wheel here, nice comfort, comfort grip, flat bottom silver spokes across the uh, steering wheel here uh, your cruise control functionalities right here your assist systems include blind spot rear traffic alert and front assist red background uh, on the gauges on both sides that's normal for the 2019 Jetta as well as the 2020 automatic headlights are going to be standard power windows with one touch up one touch down on a window lock power mirrors heated mirrors Power door locks, a little bit of a chrome finish across uh, from the door, across the dash to the other side and into the door. Cloth seats here, it's a two-tone seat, it's a gray pattern here, kind of a checkered pattern with black on the bolsters. And that's a cloth seat with an adjustable headrest right there and an adjustable uh, seat belt right there, or seat belt clip. An AM FM radio that's angled towards you as AM and FM and then you also have um, you can change um, your audio settings using that little drop down menu there rear view camera right there is completely static that stays put doesn't move uh, then you have a zinc single zone climate control here so you have your temperature uh, your fan speed and your vent settings there and the glove box no CD player um, no SD card reader there or anything like that. The SD card reader is right here. Uh, so no CD. Uh, regular mirror with the uh, dimming function. The little flip right there. Vanity mirror on each side. No light above. But you do have Carnet free for five years. And that's going to be on all of the Jettas. Free, free, uh, free for five years. Carnet. Um, a USB-C type connection right here for the S model. Uh, so you're going to need a C to a C connection if you have an Android with a C connector or a C to lightning if you have an iPhone. Armrest right here for storage. Look inside there. Nice bit of storage in there. Let's take a look at the back seat. Now with the base model S, you're only going to get two front floor mats there unless it comes with an extra set of cloth mats. Uh, then you get four. So the back seat, it's not, it's not unusual. It's not a fluke that you don't have floor mats in the back seat. Here's a look at those back seats there. Lots of room here still. Manual set up for the seats. Here's the seat back. And then there's the handle there to raise and lower the seat. And then the manual adjust is up front to slide the seat forward and back. Uh, 
stationary headrests on the outboard seats and the middle seat is adjustable no pass through or armrest there no vents back here in the back door they're on the floor underneath the seat there's a look at that alloy wheel and on the trunk space same as all Jettas before it. Nice, massive amount of trunk space here. The seats fold down. There's a seat pull here to pull and fold the seats flat. This one comes with a uh, um, roadside assistance kit, monster mats. So there's four mats there and cargo blocks there. Now an important feature about, the, or lack of a feature on the S is you get that can of fix a flat and a pump. There is no spare. So Jet S does not come with a spare. All right, there's a look at that one from the back. Moving on, we're gonna go over to the SE, which from the back doesn't look much different. Same spoilers, same type of wheel, just painted black and polished. This upgrades to keyless entry and a panoramic sunroof. This one comes in at 24 to 10. The extras on this one are gonna be uh, the auto dimming mirror with home link for 325, monster mats for 235, and cargo blocks for 85, or sorry, roadside assistance kit for 85 bucks bringing you to that 24 210 as we take a look inside this one the upgrades are leather wrap flat bottom steering wheel so from the s you had a plastic wheel and it had a sil silver spokes you have the piano black treatment here um, still using the old volkswagen logo uh, but piano black treatment on the spokes here leather wrap steering wheel with flat bottom volume control still here cruise control still here nothing's different there um, the instrument cluster is going to look the same as well. You still keep automatic headlights, power, uh, power mirrors, heated mirrors, one touch up, one touch down on the windows, power door locks. All that stuff stays the same. The radio stays the same as well. Still an AM, FM radio, no CD player or SD card reader. However, your climate control upgrades to dual zone. So now you have his and her temperature settings here. You can also adjust and sync, and this is set in Celsius, but... Uh, it still works. You can just change that there and then your audio controls are all still right there Same backup camera. It's static doesn't move, but you do have that set up right there. Also um, Electronic parking brake auto start stop on and off the other one had it as well and there's an eco button here Storage in here. You do have the same storage that you had before The seats move up to a leatherette seat with an adjustable headrest and adjustable seat belt covers Here's a look up at that panoramic sunroof. Able to see right outside. Car net right there, standard on every car. Free for five years. Also, there's your three button uh, garage door memory right there with a the compass on this home link mirror. The vanity mirror upgrades to uh, having a light above it on each side. And the glove box, still no CD player. Let's take a look at the back seats. Oh, and you do have a remote trunk release right there. There's a look at those leatherette seats. Fold down armrest in the middle right here with a cup holder right there. No pass through though. Here's a look at that panoramic sunroof on top. The headlights on the front of these are going to be the same. There's your running lights on the front of this one and the running lights on the S. It's going to be the same on the two. Not any difference there. Tail lights are gonna be the same as well. And it does say Jetta on the back. Now we move up to an SEL. I'm sorry, an R-Line, excuse me. This is a Jetta R-Line. Upgrades include black mirror caps. You still have that panoramic sunroof. You go to a 17 inch alloy wheel. Halogen fog lights on the front. Right down there. Same running lights and LED headlights as the other two over here. Just the addition of LED, I'm sorry, halogen uh, fog lights. And the grill is blacked out on these three ribs with an R-Line badge right there. An R-Line badge right here. On the back. Exhaust tips in the bumper. Integrated at the base of the bumper. Uh, they're fake exhaust tips, but they are integrated in the base. Now, this one comes in at 25,475. The extras on this one are going to be a cold weather package, which adds remote start. Um, it also adds heated front, uh, heated steering wheel, heated rear seats, and heated washer nozzles. Okay, so you also have an auto dimming rear view mirror for home link. 
for 325 and monster mats a set of four for 235 let's take a look inside of this one and surprise surprise manual seat still but you now have a different leatherette seat it's two-tone with the black on the edge shetland gray on the inside on the inset same adjustable headrest white stitching on the leather wrap steering wheel with an r-line badge down below still cruise control and your volume control all set right here still red insets in the dash for or be, behind the tachometer and the speedometer there uh, now you do still have that same am fm radio no cd player but now you have a little more black you have piano black here piano black here so uh and a remote trunk release power windows are still the same one touch up one touch down with this uh window lock here heated mirrors there trunk release was right there uh, but the piano black makes this a little sportier on the inside it goes over into the door along with that chrome there you do also have dual zone climate zone here two usb-c connectors here as well and they're backlit so they light up at night you do have the electronic parking brake, automatic start, stop, shut off, and the eco button here. And then inside is your uh, storage bin right there. There's a look at that leatherette seat there. Panoramic sunroof on top with a black headliner. That's different. Still get Carnet for free for five years. Sunglass storage right here. Vanity mirror on each side with the light. There you go. Let's take a look at the back seat. Now, when you have fog lights on your car, you do also have that cornering function. There's a look at the back seat. There's a look at the heated seat icons here. Still no vents here. Vents come out under the seats. Armrest right there with cup holders. Just look at that two-tone seat. And all of these have child seat hookups in the outboard seats. And each of these does come with a spare with the exception of the Jetta S. This one has the monster mats, cargo blocks. There's a look at the spare. And there's a look at that car. This is actually one of my favorites. That same panoramic sunroof. Moving on to the SEL. Upgraded wheel. Upgraded headlights. Now you have LED headlights that aren't just chambers. These are actually LED lenses. Um, so these are a little better driving wise. I think they look a little better too. Back to the silver grill. It says SEL on the badging on the side. This one comes in at 27,125. Upgrades on this one include auto dimming home link mirror for 325, monster mats for 235, and a bumper dillo protection plate on the rear bumper for 150. So take a look at the back. Now we did lose, we did lose the exhaust tips on the back, but we got a chrome strip on the base of the bumper. 